What's up guys, welcome back to another video, my name is Sparkman, I'm a game developer. Uh, okay, so in this project we are creating a game with zero budget, okay, which means that we are using only free programs. Now for this game we are using uh, GDevelop, which is a uh, free open source uh, game engine. This is sort of like the old game maker, which lets you make games for free. Okay, so yeah, so we want to be able to... Um, uh, the bad guy right now we can't for that we're going to need another animation another animation for this guy there let's see a new animation and uh, we're gonna use a with scale okay make sure that um, oh wait so let's add a um, edited with uh, with scale actually need this uh, maybe we do let me just uh, the pencil tool uh, duplicate that a few times and we can call this um okay it looks like we lost one frame there so let me just open um to scale again to uh, erase this oops erase this <laughs> let's make that event happen if that collision happens let me insert another um comment there collision add a new event in the condition, right collision between um, Hitbox, which is our character, and Greeno. Okay, so if that happens, we want to change the animation of um, change animation by name, object Greeno. We want to change this animation. And what did we call the animation? I forgot. We, we called it a squish. Let's call it something else, guys. There you go. Squash. Uh, I'm going to change the animation and the animation name is um, Splash. Okay. Try it out. Okay, so that kind of works. A bit slow. The animation needs to uh, happen a bit faster. Point uh, 2. Let's see a point 1. It's super fast. And um, that works fine, but he shouldn't keep walking. Okay. So um, let's make another variable for our character. Object variable, new one. This one is called alive. So he can only move if uh, if he's alive. Add condition variable greeno alive equals zero so if that turns one it shouldn't keep moving okay so let me um, do the same thing for um moving to the other direction should be um variable greeno alive equals zero i think i could have just copy the same action but so so that's that when uh, we collide with the object we should change the variable variable Modify a variable for an object. Greeno. Alive. Set to 1. Okay. See if that works. And that works right away. 